Hi everyone, in this video I would like to talk about the main difference between Citrix CR and LTSR. So if customer wants to purchase Citrix product, they can either opt, opt for CR or LTSR. So what is CR? CR means current release and what about LTSR? LTSR means long term service release. So basically when customer wants to purchase a product, he can either go for CR or LTSR. So let's say for example, if a customer is from finance industry or banking industry or healthcare or pharmaceuticals, industries like this, uh, they would not like to change uh, the environment quite frequently they want the environment to be stable and they don't want to install the updates uh, every once in a once in a couple of months or once in a few months they want the environment to be stable and if they want to make any changes to the environment they would like to take some time they would like to take you know necessary steps they would like to take the approvals so in these industries it would take a lot of time and approvals to you know push any updates in the uh, production environment so these kind of customers would uh, look for LTSR which is long term service release okay so basically when they go for long term service release they get five years time if you see here end of life it is five years it is five years so customers can take their own time to uh, push updates on the uh, product but uh, you have an option called CR which is current release some industries They would like to have latest updates all the time So they want to keep the environment up to date like you know once in a once in a couple of months or once in a uh, Once in a month if there is a new update they want to just push it they want to push it they like to use the latest features which uh, you know which are getting released by Citrix uh, latest update so so those kind of uh, customers or those kind of env environments where users always want to look, uh, users are already always looking for the latest uh, features, uh, they would like to go for current release. CR means current release and LTSR means long term service release. As you can see here, for current release, the frequency is every three to four months. Okay, every three to four months. Uh, uh, you they have to make changes in the environment but when it comes to LTSR it's long-term service release once in a couple of years they can make changes on LTSR products okay so so the end of maintenance for current release is just six months and for LTSR it is not applicable but one thing is the LTSR uh, they have to install the cumulative updates so these are the mandatory uh, updates like critical security updates or software updates that need to be installed for that uh, LTSR customers can still you know install this uh, cumulative updates so so this is the uh, major difference difference between uh, uh, CR current release and LTSR which is long-term service release so if uh, you know if if the customer wants to uh, before before a customer makes a proper decision first of all they have to think from the business point of view whether they want to uh, go for current release or ltsr so based upon the business based upon the users based upon the requirement uh, the clients or the customers can opt for either cr or long term service release okay so i hope you find this information helpful if you have any questions leave a comment and thank you for watching bye